It's the Cupcake Mommy Lives. Oh yeah. The Cupcake Mommy Lives. Mommy. Hey my friends, it's Lily. Today I'm going to share my most used up natural products. I'm in the playroom and you're going to hear and see Liam playing in the background. Hopefully Luke doesn't get all jealous that mommy's on the camera but it's actually the perfect time to film because they're playing and I'm just usually updating my blog or just watching them playing along with them but anyways with no further ado I'm gonna break it up into three categories home beauty and baby um, I got a little bit from everything so product number one is my favorite my Mr. Myers clean day countertop spray love this stuff this seriously makes me want to clean I love it it's aroma therapeutic and it's just like I just love cleaning with it I hear the basil one is really good the only con is the size so for the price it's usually I think it's like three something and it's only 16 ounces so this goes really fast I try to dilute it when it's about halfway I'll add water and it works just as fine next is my vinegar this is a bottle I got not that long ago and I'm already using it up anything that has to do with the boys with baby um, this is the most natural way to clean because the truth is even though products are marketed as natural products they still have chemicals in them so they're better choices sometimes but they're not completely natural so anything my baby's going to be putting his hands on eating um, the high chairs, this is awesome for cleaning, wiping down hard chairs, toys, because vinegar is a natural antibacterial, so I'm going to need some more soon. This is my grapeseed oil. This is a better alternative than using vegetable oil or canola, any one of those like not good oils. Grapeseed oil is excellent for baking. Um, I cook a lot of my like chicken dishes with this just because olive oil, molecularly speaking, olive oil gets rancid when you cook with it. Um, not that it's like poisonous or anything like that, but it just like breaks down and it's not as nutritious as you think. So something like grapeseed oil, coconut oil, they just hold the heat really well and their nutritional content. So that's almost used up. I love this stuff. Next, moving on to beauty. Um, I'll start off with a not so fave. This is the Good from Burt's Bee. It's their brand. I bought this at Target. It smells amazing. I love it's a vanilla and rice milk. Um, scent. It smells really good. My only problem I had with this, uh, paraben free, so that's what one of the main reasons why I wanted to get a paraben free lotion. I just feel like it doesn't absorb into the skin very well. I really have to like massage it in for the for my leg not to look white anymore. So it's just weird, like it doesn't absorb that well. But probably won't be purchasing this again. Um, I'll be looking for something different. Um, next is my Nature's Gate conditioner, sulfate free um, tea tree oil conditioner. I love this because it's good for dry flaky scalp and that's just what I tend to have. So I love that it's sulfate free and this conditioner works. Like it makes my hair feel soft. Like I love this conditioner. So I repurchased this probably like three times already. The shampoo and conditioner. The conditioner is empty but I love this and I will be repurchasing it. Next is a product from Burt's Bee, so this one gets a yay. It's just their um, nourishing lip balm with mango butter. I love this stuff. It's been getting me through the winter, and I just love the ingredients. It's are very simple. They're all natural oils, and I just love that. One last thing in beauty is my Dr. Bruner's Magic Soaps. This is in the lavender, uh, the hemp lavender pure castle, castle soap made with organic oils. This stuff seriously like fills up my shower with just aroma. I love it and um, it's definitely one of my faves. It's my first time trying anything from this brand. I'm pretty shocked because I see it all the time. There's Luki grunting. I see it all the time but I don't, I've never bought anything from it. So it's five bucks for this little bar of soap. It is expensive but you get what you pay for. It's 100% vegan. Um, obviously vegetable base with peppermint, lavender, almond, eucalyptus, tea tree. I just, I love this stuff. And when it comes to like my body, I don't play that. Then lastly, baby, I just have two products. My California Baby uh, shampoo and body wash. Love this stuff. I love how it smells. I love putting it on the babies. It just, it's one of my favorite body washes. But the con is that it is expensive. Just this thing is like $12. But I will say that Luki is six months and it lasted me six months. So $12 for a product that lasts you six months is not bad at all. 
On the cheaper side, I actually I bought um, for Liam. He started off with California Baby, and then we moved on to Johnson's Natural. Um, it's 98% natural, which I'm like, what's the two percent that makes it unnatural? But um, anyways, smells not my favorite, but I just use it for what it is. It's just um, plant and fruit derived ingredients, and that's just what my babies use. Um, let me know what you use for your babies, but anyways, those are some of my favorites. I hope that this video was not too distracting with Liam playing with his imagination, but it's actually one of my favorite things to just overhear him talking and all his little, man, it's super cute. Alright, thanks for watching. Hey, this is Donna, and I have come back to buy more cupcakes. They are the most awesome thing I've found. They don't ride up, they're comfortable, they hide the scissors when you don't want anything to show, and I wear them all the time. So, way to go, Lily. Great product. Thanks.